What's up guys? This is Brent with Western Equipment. Now let's jump right on in and first talk about what the different colors of wrap mean. Now, most of what we see in the field today is going to be a mixture of either yellow or pink. But as of late, some of the colors that you might see are going to also include blue. Now, whenever we're talking about the Tama brand wrap, which is going to be the brand that works with John Deere to get that wrap out there. And that is going to be the John Deere branded wrap, which is by Tama. So they are going to offer three different colors like we talked about, which is going to be the yellow, the pink and the blue. Now, if you're familiar with these wraps, you know that the blue wrap is also called the blue value wrap, which we'll talk a little bit more about that here in a minute. But the main two colors that we see a lot of the time are going to be yellow and pink. Now, this is going to be Tama's premium wrap. This is called the Tama wrap plus premium and so what you will see like i said are these big yellow bales here and then you may also see this pink color that we see right here also now these wraps are going to be made all exactly the same they are made out of the same material the only difference is going to be that whenever we move to the blue value roll there is going to be a lower cost there it's usually between eight to eight to 10% less a roll. And what the difference is there is it will tell you on Tama's website that there is a difference in the robustness of the roll, that there is a likelihood of possibility of more damage with the blue. And the reason for that being is has to do with the adhesive that is used on these different colors of wrap. Now, all three of these wraps are going to be made exactly the same. They're made out of the same plastic. They're all going to have the over the edge cover. They're going to have the UV protection that lasts for a minimum of six months. They are all going to have RFID tags on each individual wrap. That way that those bales or modules can be linked back to that specific customer. And they're also going to all have the pre-cut wraps that are all on the roll. So what I mean by that is is on each roll, there is going to be enough wrap for 24 modules, which this right here is a module. This a lot of times gets called a bale of cotton, but a bale of cotton is actually referring to the finished product after this has been has gone through the gin. So right here is a module and each one of those rolls is going to have enough of this plastic covering, whether we're talking about yellow, pink or blue to cover 24 modules. They are gonna have pre-cut strips. So that means once they get to the end of the wrapping process, there does not have to be a knife on that machine that cuts this product. And the reason for that is the more times that this has to be cut, the more chance that we have plastic contamination and any contamination that's in the cotton that could be hard on the gin is something that we definitely want to avoid. So Tama has gone through, designed this wrap to have all of those features across all three colors. Now, the big difference between the yellow and pink versus the blue is going to be that the blue is the value wrap. So therefore, there had to be a sort of cost reduction somewhere in the production of that product. So what they came up with was they lessened the amount of adhesive that is in the blue wrap versus the yellow and pink. So on the yellow and pink, what we're going to have is we're going to have that adhesive strip that goes all the way down the length of the plastic wrap. So we have adhesive from here all the way around to where it wraps on the other edge of the bale. Now the length of this adhesive that goes around a pink or a yellow wrap is going to be 35 feet. So basically what that means is you're going to have adhesive adhesive all the way around this bale and actually have a little bit extra whenever we're making that next wrap. Because on each one of these, this is not a single sheet of plastic, you're going to have a little over two wraps on each one of these modules. Now, whenever we move to the blue value wrap, which you can see right here, now it says on Tama's website that you could have the possibility of having more damage. So one thing that I like to point out is if we kind of look at this bale here, versus one of the blue ones here, you can see that the blue has a lot more surface area touching the ground. And that's because it is going to be a less robust module because of the fact that instead of having that 35 feet going around the bale, the adhesive strip on a blue module is only 18 inches wide. So we have to think 18 inches all the way down the side of this bale and then just plastic all the way around the rest of the way. So whereas a yellow or pink is gonna have 35 feet. So we have adhesive, like I said, all the way around this bale, which helps to hold that bale together better. 
and also to keep it together when we're talking about cutting this plastic off when we get to the gin process. So there is where the difference lies in the colors alone. Now, whenever we're talking about the pink, there is a special thing about the pink, and this does have to do with breast cancer awareness. So a really neat story about how this came about, and you can actually read this on Tama's website, but I'll go ahead and tell you right here is back in 2012, there was a farmer that had reached out to Tama. He had unfortunately and tragically lost his sister who was dealing with a battle with breast cancer and happened to lose her at the tragic age of 33. And he wanted a way that he could put that awareness out there in a way to honor her in his farming operation. And what he came up with was coming up with a pink wrap to go around his modules that could be sitting out in the field, that could go be hauled down the road and be at the gin where people would think, what is the deal with this pink wrap? And therefore, the breast cancer awareness pink became a color from Tama. He reached out to Tama, talked to them there, told them what his idea was, and sure enough, they got him some ready by the 2013 season. And now it is one of the most popular colors that you can buy of wrap today. Now, another incredible thing that Tama decided to do is that along with creating this amazing product to put out there with the pink color to show awareness for this horrible disease is they also decided that with every palette and every roll of this pink wrap that's purchased, they are going to contribute to a breast cancer awareness foundation and research foundation to make sure that they are doing something to help honor all those people out there that are dealing with this very nasty disease. So that is also an amazing thing that you can keep in mind is if you are that cotton customer out there and you have one of these machines that uses this wrap, if you want to contribute to a very nice cause, an easy way to do it is buying a product that you're already going to buy, except instead of yellow or blue, buy the pink. It's as easy as that. Now, if you've never seen these bales before, these modules of cotton before, here's gonna be a little bit of footage um, of some blue bales, also of some pink, and then of course we do have our yellow as well which is what I'm standing next to also so here's what these are going to look like and now you'll know that when you see these big white fluffy things out in the middle of a field that are wrapped in these different colors you'll know exactly what they mean and what they are for now keep in mind like I talked about there is that stigma that the blue is completely different from the yellow and the pink and that is not the case they are going to be structured exactly the same like we talked about they're going to be made of the same material the only difference is going to be in that adhesive strip so if the saving the eight to ten percent is something that you definitely think would be good for your operation if you are a cotton operator then the blue value might be the way to go if you want that extra protection extra robustness of that extra adhesive on these bales, then we definitely want to look at either the yellow or the pink. Now, some of the other things that you will hear also is that sometimes whenever we have that blue value wrap is that gins may get just a little bit upset at you because sometimes they can be a little bit more work whenever removing this plastic. And that's just because there isn't as much adhesive on the bale itself to keep that plastic all together. So sometimes whenever they are cut at these gins, they will come off in separate pieces. And that all goes back to that adhesive. So guys, I hope this video helped you out. I hope that this answered any questions that you might have had. I hope you liked this video. If you did, we just ask you to hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Also guys, if you need any John Deere parts at all, make sure to go check us out at 247parts.com. And as always, thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. Hey guys, make sure to check out this cool video and this one. Buy your parts right up here and subscribe right here.